Some owners of the Samsung Galaxy S10 have been complaining because the error, messages keep stopping, shows up the moment they open the messaging app or send a text message. The error actually means that the default texting application has stopped working. A problem like this can be a sign of a minor app-related issue, or it can be a serious problem with the firmware since messages is a pre-installed application. Hey guys, I'm RJ from thecellguide.com, and in this video, I will show you what to do if messages keeps crashing on your Galaxy S10. First solution, perform the forced restart. For issues like this, it's always the best choice to do the forced restart before doing anything else. It's because the problem could be just a result of a minor glitch in the system. The forced restart is a simulated battery removal that refreshes your phone's memory as well as reloads its apps and services. It's pretty effective against minor firmware issue. Here's how it's done. Press the volume down button and the power key at the same time, and hold them together for 10 seconds or until the logo shows. Once the phone has successfully rebooted, try to see if the app still crashes. Second solution, clear the cache and data of messages app. It is a possible issue with the app, the next thing you have to do is to reset messages. Such procedure has already been proven to be effective, against app related problems. Here's how it's done. Tap and hold on the messages icon until options show. Tap app info. Touch storage. Tap clear cache. Now, tap clear data and touch OK to confirm. If the problem continues after this procedure, then move on to the next solution. Third solution, factory reset your phone. After doing the first two procedures and messages still crashes, the next thing you have to do is for the firmware, because it's possible that the app crashes are just a result of a system error. Before the reset, make sure to back up all your files and data. When ready, follow these steps to reset your phone. Swipe down from the top of the screen and then tap the settings icon. Find and tap general management. Touch reset. Tap factory data reset. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen and tap reset. If prompted, enter your pin, password or pattern. Finally, tap delete all. A reset will surely fix this problem as long as the firmware has not been modified. I hope that this troubleshooting guide has been helpful. Please subscribe to our channel and enable notifications so you can stay up to date with the cell guide.